Hello everybody, welcome back to Let's Play with Pokemon Sword. Last time we left off, we got a lot of stuff done, and let's finish up this part of the quest, shall we? Re uh, Kelterax, I'm gonna catch you, and it's gonna be great. Uh, to do, uh, oh uh, wait, uh, do you want to, uh, I, wait. Do you want to ready, uh, your Pokeballs in order to catch Kelterax? Yep. This is like a standard Pokemon fight. If you faint it, yeah, it's over. And I believe we're inside an area where light doesn't touch us, so Dark Ball should work just fine. I don't want to necessarily do much damage, because he is quad weak to uh, Dark now, because he is a... Oh, jeez. He's a psychic ghost type now, so he's quad weak to uh, uh, Dark. I don't want to do a lot of damage, though. Uh, let's use Aerial Ace. It's level 80, so it shouldn't do that much damage. Okay. Gaga Drain. That hurt. Oh boy, that hurt a lot. Uh, you know what? Let's hit over that, uh, that iron head. How does it what an iron head do to you? Oh, enough. Oh, definitely enough. Uh, I do. Do I have any more healing items? Because I would love to use those. Got a moon milk, sure. Thrill to bits. Agility, upping your speed, are ya? That's fine. Uh, I could start lobbing balls, or I could just go for one more hit. I think one more area location shouldn't kill it. Okay, no, but you're asking for trouble now. Okay. Throw a dust ball. One. One shake. That's fine. Giga Drain's only worth. I, I think Giga Drain only has 10 PP, so that was five uses of it, so it's halfway done. Grim. No. Oh, crap. Uh, sure, let's send out you. Rillaboom, you gotta hold your own for a bit here. Please don't knock it out. Uh, I want to make sure. Does this mean I can't catch it anymore? Wait, I can? Wait, this is a re... You can keep fighting this thing? I mean, that's cool. I also... Can I use the corporate attack to get back up here? Uh, yes, I can. I'm gonna heal, and I'm gonna restart that, because that... Ugh. I know there are some Pokemon in the DLC that if you faint them, you could just, you know, catch or try to catch them again. I'm going to try to avoid that, because I don't remember which ones are which. I think he's one of them, and then... Actually, I think it's just some Reggies that are one time. Like, if you miss it one time, you're done. Like, you have to restart the entire thing. I think in his case, he's a Pokemon you could just keep battling. I'm going to keep saving just to make sure. But I also don't want to kill it once again, so I'm going to try not to just completely obliterate it. Yep. Yep.
I guess I also know it, it can now stand a couple head, uh, iron heads, so let's try it. I think Iron Hands will also be the best way to go about it. Astral Barrage? That's a ghost type move, so that won't do a whole lot. Wow, you suck. Hey, you're gonna use Mega Drain. I'm gonna see if I can just hit you hard. Yeah, there. Oh, I don't go. Wicked blow. Are you kidding me? All oh, right, that that's always a crit though. Oh, uh, that's why. Okay, well this is gonna take some doing. It's gonna take some doing not to kill this thing. Yeah, good, good. You're testing me. I was testing you too. Oh boy. This is going to take a while. I mean, to be fair, I could also go ahead and go buy some actual balls I need. Like, you know, quick balls, timer balls. Go restock on actual things I need. That's what a smart person would do, except, you know, that's not how we do it here, apparently. Come on, Urshifu, you're like the one Pokemon that can stand against this thing. So, Wicked Blow, probably not the best option. I'm back. I mean, this is also a pretty good way to grind up levels if you can really afford to do it. Yes, yes, come on. All is one. Yeah, please, hit me again green right off the bat. He has about half his HP. A little under half. Okay. Get you down to there and start blowing balls again. Now you want shake. Okay, well, if you're going to keep using Mega uh, Giga Drain, I'll just switch out for Groovy at this point. Okay, cool. Okay, 80 power. This should not kill you. Will it hurt you? Yes, it should not kill you. Or faint you in this case. Why? Just why do you do that? Uh Yeah, I got like a lot of berries. Can I just camp here? Yep. Gotta make some mumbo curry at this point. Got an apple, and then we got citrus berries, because that's all you guys get. Fancy apple! I think it's a bad job. Tayon loves, uh, seems to love this. Get 
nice and hot. Time to stir you. Oh, don't spill now. And boom. If this is gonna start taking like attempts now, I might as well just use the camping. Everyone get some apple curry. Okay, PP and HP has been fully restored. Wow, they got like a thousand experience from that. Holy crap. I'm back again, come on. This is gonna take a while. Cause like you have a pretty decent catch rate, I thought. If I caught this guy, I believe in a tire ball last time. I guess it's also more or less an uh, LP curse situation. Yep. You only really eat berries, which I have none on. Iron Head. Start off with agility. Great. Seems distracted. Agility again. Okay, you're down in the red. Throw a dust ball. Not in one shake. So you're just gonna be on soft blow when it comes to speed then is what you're getting at. Wanna go into Great Ball? Or sorry, Ultra Ball? One, two, three. Gotcha. Okay, so this is a count as a cave then. Because if it count as a cave, that would have gone off a lot faster. Okay, well in that case, eh, it still works in my favor. Okay, be added to the Pokedex. The High King Pokemon. The Shadow Rider. Uh-huh, Pokemon is bound to the Gala region. Yep. Cool. I can be that any given time. I'm gonna call you Rex. Careful now, Rex! Careful now, Rex! Human child, uh, uh, no, I should not... Okay. Yes, refer to me by name, please. I've heard of the adventures, adventures that we might have. Yep. Big guy Pokemon talking to the weird shrine. Mm -hmm. All felt so real. Yeah, it, it, it didn't happen, buddy. Don't worry about it. Everything's under control. Heck. And now, this one is case and close. We're done. We'll report back to him soon. Right now, we're let's go up to Winchurch and Winchurch and uh, get a freak ton of, freak ton of uh, quick balls. I'm getting really impatient with the, the balls I have. Because there are, there is only one, there, there, there's only one more thing we have to do, and it's going to require a lot of freaking patience. Thank God, it's only 11, so we're only, we're only going to get 12 more quick balls. That's still more than enough what I need. Because as, as I said, I think I said it numerous times. 
Quick Balls are only good on turn one. They're not good on any other turn. I wish I could have bought some more uh, Ultra Balls and such, but I guess that might not happen. As I am going to look at my berries and see which ones I could sell. Because, like, I'm going to just look at whatever I could sell for a high price at this point. Uh, yeah, these are also just fairly common in general, so. Just sell all the ingredients. I don't really cook in these games anyways. I wouldn't mind also selling some of these. What do we have, like, an incredible amount of wild charge here? Yep. Get rid of that. And yes, I'm prepping up for the next part, because the next part will take uh, forever if we don't prep up for it. I mean, I guess TOs in general you can just sell outright, because there's never really a point I feel like I need to use them. Like, if I want to change one of my teams, like, super drastically, then probably, but, like, I don't want to change a lot of my stuff right now. And then all of this stuff is rare regardless. Okay, right, cool. So let's spend the rest of the money on Ultra Balls. Thank you. Oh, I probably should have bought some potions too. And we can buy potions at, at any given old time. It's fine. So, now let's get ready for one of the most monotonous things in the DLC, which is the Legendary Birds. You're probably thinking like, oh, what's so wrong with the Legendary Birds? Nothing in in theory. Everything when it comes to practice. Because I'm really bad at this stuff. So, going right back down to the Crown Tundra. Uh, let's just warp to the Giant's Bed. Because this would make a lot more sense if we do it just like this. So, from the Giant's Bed, let's... This is not the place I wanted to warp from. Actually, it is. Nope, we're good. Because I was like, I'm probably on the wrong side of the map. And it's like, nope, I'm on the right side. So, moving right along to the giant tree that's been taunting us since we got here. We're going to start the birds. And then when we're done the birds, that is the end of the story for the DLC. It does unlock a couple new things for us, but once again... Right now, I'm worried about the story, and there is a little bit more to the story, but it's not directly connected to this storyline. This storyline is something else, and then the other thing connected to the storyline is something that's more of a minigame, slash you don't have to do it, for the for the DLC completion, story-wise. And you're probably thinking, like, oh, why is it so important to you? Uh, mostly just because I want to be done with this LP for right now and move on to bigger projects. Excuse me. Oh, we got one of the birds. Hi. And there's another one. But there was memory three, and there's the last one. Hi, don't the bad time. Really bad time to call us. Uh, well, you missed our, our shot for most Pokemon, so what do you got? Great news, uh-huh. Got a dodgy bird uh, Pokemon popping up left and right. 
Uh, pointed feathers, the one in the wild area. Uh, uh, the fury, uh, fury, uh, furious looking one went to the island of armor. And the uh, fancy, uh, gracious one is appearing and flying around Tundra. It wouldn't be something to turn out to be the bird of the one I wrote about in the clues. Yep. And we could have caught them right here. A legendary tree of a legendary with uh, a legendary tree of a legendary three. And now we've got an ultra mega completed for uh, ultra ultra mega completely forgot that I uh, was going to call you in the first place. Uh, life's too short to sweat the small stuff. Uh, yeah, I mean it would have been great if we put our phone if our Rotom phone went on silent mode. Okay, one in the wild area, one in the crown tundra, and one the uh, one in the crown tundra, and one in, one in the island of armor. So since we're here in the crown tundra, let's get let's get the crown tundra done out of the way. One done done and out of the way. Also, I do not want to fight you. Alteria, a flying dragon type. Do we have anything that'd be good against a flying dragon type? Not really. Uh. Let's just use Wicked Blow. I'm not, plan I'm not planning to use that on any of them. Thank you. Okay. So, the one in the Crown Tundra is going to be flying about, but it has set locations. So, let's just go to location one and hope it's there. If not, it has, I believe, two other locations that it usually flies to. So, let's mosey along and hope we just get this done. I want to get at least one in this episode so we can focus on the other two in the next episode. Can we not run into things? Thank you. It should be flying right about here. No. Is it not around here? Gotta look up a little bit because it's up in the sky, obviously. There's Eevee. Where are you, buddy? It doesn't really go near town, does it? Oh, wait, I heard it, I heard it, I heard it. Where is it? I heard that cry. I know you're around here, buddy. No, Susie, where the frick are you? Are you... Ah! Oh, wait, no, I think it's near the train station. Is it not? Because I think one of the locations is near the train station. Uh, let's try the train station, I guess. I'm also kind of on a strict timeline for this. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna go near the train station and pray it's there. If not, I know where it is. Because it doesn't. It shows up as a regular Pokemon, so you can see it from, like, mostly anywhere. Okay, nothing so far. Okay, so it might be where I think it is. It might be in the mountains. Yep, because it's not near a train station, it means it's near the mountains. Uh, I might have to wander around a bit to find this guy, so I think I'm going to call it an episode here, and then when we resume, we'll find the bird that we're looking for.
So I will see you guys whenever I find it. See you guys later.